please kneel. O sacred feast, in which we partake of Christ, his sufferings are remembered, our minds are filled with his grace, and we receive the pledge of the glory which is to be ours. You gave them bread from heaven to be their food, and this bread contained all goodness. Let us pray. Lord, Lord Jesus Christ, Christ you gave us the Eucharist, as the memorial of your suffering and death. May our worship of the sacrament of your body and blood help us to experience the salvation you want for us and the peace of the kingdom where you live with the Father and the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, and she conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us and us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be it done unto me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us and us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the Word was made flesh and dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us and us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. For forth, forth we beseech you, O Lord, 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 your grace into our hearts, that we, to whom the incarnation of Christ, your Son, was made known by the message of an angel, may by his passion and cross be brought to the glory of his resurrection, through the same Christ, our Lord. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Let us meditate on the joyful mysteries. The first joyful mystery, the Annunciation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us and us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us and us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in this, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, 
full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us and us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us and us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us and us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, as now, and will be forever. Amen. The second joyful mystery, the visitation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginnings, now and will be, forever. Amen. The third joyful mystery, the birth of Christ. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. 
Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fourth joyful mystery, the presentation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, 
and blessed is the fruit of her womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of her womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. <coughs> Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. The fifth joyful mystery, the finding of the child Jesus in the temple. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us at us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us at us, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. We fly to your patronage, O Holy Mother of God. Despise not our petitions and our necessities, but deliver us from all dangers, O ever glorious and blessed Virgin. Queen of the Holy Rosary of Manawag, pray for us, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, o God whose only begotten Son, Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, as which is for us the rewards of eternal life, grant we beseech you that meditating upon these mysteries of the Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain in obtain what they promise through Christ our Lord. Amen. Behold the faithful and prudent steward whom the Lord has set over his household. The Lord has shown him his love and covered him with glory. He has clothed them with a splendid garment. Let us pray. Father, Father you entrusted our Savior to the care of St. Joseph. By the help of his prayers, may your church continue to serve her Lord Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. 
Amen. Amen. Jubilee Prayer O God, our Father and Creator, in whom we live and move and have our being, we praise you as we gather in gentle grace and gratitude on this Jubilee of the Dominican Province of the Philippines. O God the Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, we preach you as the way, the truth, and the life, whose name we proclaim, whose love we strive to incarnate. O God, the Holy Spirit, advocate and guide, we bless you and seek the outpouring of your presence in the witness of our words and works, in the consecration of our lives to holy preaching, in speaking only to you and about you. Let our celebration be filled with fidelity to our mission, with hope for your promise, and with true charity binding us all. In the gospel we share with all peoples. By your will, O God, in your name, O Lord. Amen. Our Lady of the Holy Rosary, pray for us. Our Holy Father, Saint Dominic, pray for us. Please be seated for a while. Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. Today, we celebrate the memorial of St. John Chrysostom, Bishop and Doctor of the Church. Born in Antioch, Syria, St. John was given the moniker Chrysostom, or Golden Mountain, because of his eloquent and powerful preaching. <clears throat> he entered the monastic life and was later consecrated Archbishop of Constantinople. His resolve in the midst of controversy distinguish him as much as his many writings on the Catholic doctrine and Christian life. He died in exile. We will now have the morning prayer of a church integrated with the Holy Mass. We invite you to actively participate in our prayers. Please stand. Lord, open my lips, and my and mouth shall declare your grace. Come, let us worship Christ, Chief Shepherd of the flock. Come, Come let us worship Christ, Christ, Chief Shepherd of the flock. Cry out with joy to the Lord, all the earth. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before Him, singing for joy. Come, let us worship Christ, Chief Shepherd of the flock. Know that He, the Lord, is God. He made us, we belong to Him. We are his people, the sheep of his flock. Come, Come let us worship Christ, the chief shepherd of the flock. Go within his gates giving thanks. Enter his courts with songs of praise. Give thanks to him and bless his name. Come, Come let, let us worship Christ, the chief, chief shepherd of the flock. Indeed, how good is the Lord, eternal his merciful love. He is faithful from age to age. Come, let us worship Christ, Chief Shepherd of the flock. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. Come, let us worship Christ, Chief Shepherd of the flock. Please be seated. Each morning, Lord, you fill us with your kindness. O Lord, you have been our refuge from one generation to the next, before the mountains were born, or the earth or the world brought forth. You are God without beginning or end. You turn men back to chant the dust, and say, Go back, sons of men. In your eyes a thousand years are like yesterday, come and gone, no more than a watch in the night. You sweep men away like a dream, like grass which springs up in the morning. In the morning it springs up and flowers, by evening it withers and fades. So we are destroyed in your anger, struck with terror and your fury. Our guilt lies open before you, 
our secrets in the light of your face. All our days pass away in your anger. Our life is over like a sigh. Our span is seventy years, or eighty for those who are strong. And most of these are emptiness and pain. They pass swiftly and we are gone. Who understands the power of your anger and fears the strength of your fury? Make us know the shortness of our life, that we may gain wisdom of heart. Lord, relent. Is your anger forever? Show pity to your servants. In the morning, fill us with your love. We shall insult and rejoice in all their days. Give us to balance our affliction for the years when they knew misfortune. Show forth your word to your servants. Let your glory shine on their children. Let the favor of the Lord be upon us. Give success to the work of our hands. Give success to the work of our hands. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and will be, forever. Amen. From the farthest bounds of the earth, may God be praised. Sing to the Lord a new song, His praise from the ends of the earth. Let the sea and what it fills it resound, the coastlands and those who dwell in them. Let the step and its cities cry out, the villages where Kedar dwells. Let the inhabitants of Salah exult and shout from the top of mountains. Let them give glory to the Lord and utter His praise in the coastlands. The Lord goes forth like a hero, like a warrior he stirs up his ardor. He shouts out his battle cry. Against his enemies he shows his might. I have looked away and kept silence. I have said nothing holding myself in, but now I cry out as a woman in labor, gasping and panting. I will lay waste mountains and hills, all their herbage I will dry up. I will turn the rivers into marshes, and the marshes I will dry up. I will lead the blind on their journey, by paths unknown I will guide them. I will turn darkness into light before them, and make crooked ways straight. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. You who stand in His sanctuary, praise the name of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise Him, servants of the Lord, who stand in the house of the Lord, in the courts of the house of our God. Praise the Lord, for the Lord is good. Sing a psalm to His name, for He is loving. For the Lord has chosen Jacob for himself, and Israel for his own possession. For I knew the Lord is great, that our Lord is high above all gods. The Lord does whatever He wills, in heaven and earth, in the seas. He summons clouds from the ends of the earth, makes lightning produce the rain. From His treasuries He sends forth the wind. The firstborn of the Egyptians He smote of man and beast alike. Signs and wonders he worked in the midst of your land, O Egypt, against Pharaoh and all his servants. Nations and their greatness he struck, and kings and their splendor he slew. Zion, king of the Amorites, Og, the king of Bashan, and all the kingdoms of Canaan, who let Israel inherit their land. On his people their land he bestowed. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Please stand. Let us pray. O God, strength of those who hope in you, who will that the Bishop St. John Chrysostom should be illustrious by his wonderful eloquence and his experience of suffering, grant we pray that instructed by his teachings, we may be strengthened through the example of his invincible patience. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever. And never. Amen. Please be seated. 
A reading from the first letter of St. Paul to Timothy. Beloved, first of all, I ask that supplications, prayers, petitions, and thanksgivings be offered for everyone, for kings and for all in authority, that we may lead a quiet and tranquil life in all devotion and dignity. This is good and pleasing to God our Savior, who wills everyone to be saved and to come to knowledge of the truth. For there is one God, there is also one mediator between God and men, the man Christ Jesus, who gave himself as ransom for all. This was the testimony at the proper time. For this I was appointed preacher and apostle. I am speaking the truth, I am not lying. Teacher of the Gentiles in faith and truth, it is my wish, then, that in every place the men should pray, lifting up holy hands without anger or argument. The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Blessed be the Lord, for He has heard my prayer. Blessed be the Lord, for He has heard my prayer. Hear the sound of my pleading when I cry to you, lifting up my hands toward your holy shrine. Blessed be the Lord, for He has heard my prayer. The Lord is my strength and my shield. In Him my heart trusts, and I find help. Then my heart exalts, and with my song I give Him thanks. Blessed be the Lord, for He has heard my prayer. The Lord is the strength of His people, the, sa the saving refuge of His anointed. Save your people and bless your inheritance. Feed them and carry them forever. Blessed be the Lord, for He has heard my prayer. Please stand. gave His only begotten Son, so that everyone who believes in Him might have eternal life. your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Glory to you, O Lord. When Jesus had finished all his words to the people, he entered Capernaum. A centurion there had a slave who was ill and about to die, and he was valuable to him. When he heard about Jesus, he sent elders of the Jews to him, asking him to come and save the life of his slave. They approached Jesus and strongly urged him to come, saying, He deserves to have you do this for him, for he loves our nation, and he built the synagogue for us and Jesus went with with them but when he was but when he was only a short dis distance from the house the centurion sent friends to tell him Lord do not trouble yourself for I am not worthy to have you enter under my roof Therefore, I did not consider myself worthy to come to you. But say the word, and let my servant be healed. For I, too, am a person subject to authority, with soldiers subject to me. And I say to one, go, and he goes, and to another, come here 
and he comes and to my slave do this and he does it when Jesus heard this he was amazed at him and turning said to the crowd following him I tell you not even in Israel have I found such faith when the messengers returned to the house they found the slave in good health the gospel of the Lord praise to you Lord Jesus Christ please be seated Habang tumatagal ang pandemya, marami ang nangangailangan ng dasal. Araw-araw, pag binasa ko ang messenger ko, palaging may request, Father, padasal naman. Lalong-lalo na yung mga sa malayong lugar, at um, mahirap marating ng ating mga health workers katulad ng mga tao sa Tamigin Island North ilan sa kanila ang nasa facilities ng barangay ngunit hindi nila alam kung kailan sila makalis dahil kulang sa mga gamit kung paano sila matest at dahil sa malayo talagang kailangan nila ang dasal sabi nila Father, ipagdasal mo na lang kami hindi namin alam kung ano ang mangyari sa amin hindi lang yung mga tinamaan ng virus na ito ang mga nagpadasal Maraming mga kaibigan na mga health workers, mga doctors at nurses na humingi din ng dasal. Lalong-lalo na sa panahon kung saan parang naramdaman nila na kulang ang pag-aalaga sa kanila. Kulang ang atensyon ng authorities para sa kanilang kapakanan at for their own safety. Kaya, kailangan natin magdasal. Kailangan natin iparating sa Diyos ang kanilang mga hinihinaing Dahil sa pamamagitan ng ating pagdarasal, ang Diyos ay nakikinig. At itong sinasabi sa atin ng ating unang pagbasa from a letter of St. Paul to Timothy. Sabi niya, Beloved, first of all, I ask that supplications, prayers, petition, and thanksgiving be offered for everyone, for kings, and for all in authority, that we may be led a quiet and tranquil life. So, Nasal, hindi dapat sa gusto lang natin pagdasal. Ang dasal ay para sa lahat. At ito siguro dahil nakikita ni San Pablo ng mga tao noon ang nagdarasal ay para lamang sa kanila ayaw nilang pagdasal ang mga Gentiles. Ayaw nila pagdasal yung hindi nila kasama sa kanilang paniniwala. Ang pagdarsal ay binigay ng ating Panginoon 
para sa lahat dahil siya mismo ay hindi namimili sa kanyang mga pagtulong lalong-lalo na sa kanyang pagpagaling sa kanyang mga milagro na ginagagawa hindi namimili ang ating Panginoon kung sino lamang ang kanyang pagalingin Jew Gentiles lahat na mga nangangailangan ng kanyang tulong ay kanyang pinapagaling sa ating banghilyo sa umagang ito atin narinig Ayon sa Ebanghelyo ni San Lucas, kung paano natugunan ng ating Panginoon ang isang dasal. At ito ay nanggagaling sa isang centurion, isang gentile, isang pagano. Ngunit, iba ang nakita ng ating Panginoon sa sinturyo na ito, sa officer na ito, sa authority na ito. Sabi nga ni San Lucas, Jesus was amazed when he heard the faith, the expression of faith of the sinturyon. Bakit? Kasi kuminsan, mahirap pag-isahin yung authority at humility. Pag sinabing authority, otoridad ka, ay, ah, ikaw masunod. Ikaw yung pinakamataas. Kung anong gusto mo, yun dapat ang sundin ng mga sakop mo. Ngunit ito iba. Very sensitive ang sintoryo na ito. Alam niya. Alam niya. Ibang-iba siya. Merong pagmamahal. Merong pagmamalasakit sa kanya mga sinasakupan. At ito sa kanyang slay. Nakita niya na nangangailangan ang kanyang katulong dahil may sakit baka mamatay niya. At alam ng sentoryo na ito ang mga nagagawa ng ating Panginoon. Kaya on his own, he did not personally approach Jesus, but rather as some elders of the community to tell Jesus regarding his prayers, his requests, na sana po pagalingin ang kanyang katulong. The centurion is sensitive enough that he could not personally approach Jesus because He is a Gentile. Kaya, Jesus answered his prayers, his requests, at papunta na siya sa bahay ng sintorion. But upon approaching, again the sintorion told those people, whom he sent, that Jesus may not enter under his roof. Lord, do not trouble yourself, for I am not worthy to have you and enter under my roof. Bakit? Alam niya. Alam niya na 
Jesus will be affected pag pumasok siya sa bahay ng Gentile. Maraming mga tao na kakakita will be defiled. So very sensitive itong tao na ito na ayaw niya ilagay sa trobo lang ating Panginoon. Kaya sabi niya, just only say the word and the servant will be healed. No. Huwag ka nang pumasok sa bahay namin. Sabihin mo lang kung anong gusto mo na mangyari sa ating utusan. And it happened. When the messenger returned to the house, they found the slave in good health. Mga kapatid, hindi lahat-lahat na mga may authority, mga salbahe, may mga taong with authority, ngunit may puso para sa kanila mga sako. Ito ang dapat tularan ng ating mga leaders. Ito ang dapat na ipanalangin natin na mangyari lalong-lalo na sa panahon ngayon. Even St. John Chrysostom whose memory we are celebrating today urge the church to pray for those in authority that they may be enlightened and be converted and return to God. Yun lang ang kailangan natin siguro ipagdasal na yun. Dahil kapag ma-enlighten natin yung mga authorities natin, makikita nila ang katotohanan. Hindi sila maging magbulag-bulagan o magbingi-bingian sa mga nangyayari, lalong-lalo na sa mga naghihirap at mahihirap. Ipagdasal natin, God is listening and God works even from a distance. Alam ng Diyos ang lahat-lahat na pangyayari. But the need is only to surrender and allow God to work. Pero din sa lahat ng mga may sakit. Our faith Heals, and Jesus is telling us for that. What we need is our continued prayer. A prayer that comes from the heart and not from the lips. A prayer that unites our minds with God. So mga kapatid, Huwag tayo mawala ng pag-asa, lalong-lalo na sa ating sitwasyon. We trust to God and we surrender everything to His plan. Mayayari ito dahil may plano ang Diyos para sa atin. At alam ko, ang plano ng Diyos ay para sa ating kapakanan para sa ating kabutihan. Kailangan lamang na bumalik tayo sa Kanya. We all stand with faith as strong as that of the centurion 
Let us approach the Lord and pray for the needs of the church and of the world. For every intention we say, Lord, bless us who are unworthy. Lord, bless us who are unworthy. That the church in all places may consider no one a foreigner or an outsider. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, bless us who are unworthy. That those who govern our civil life may treat every person with justice and equality. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, bless us who are unworthy. That we may learn to understand and accept those people who differ from us in belief, race, or background. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, bless us who are unworthy. That the elderly, the lonely, and the sick may receive the comfort of God's love in their distress. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, bless us who are unworthy. For our Pope, the College of Bishops, for our parents, relatives, benefactors, and for all those whom we promise to pray, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, bless us who are unworthy. For the Master of the Order and his assistants, and for our brothers and ministry at Santo Domingo and Our Lady of the Holy Rosary, we pray. Lord, bless us who are unworthy. That our departed brothers and sisters may be welcomed into the kingdom of eternal life. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, bless us who are unworthy. For the intentions of the devotees and pilgrims of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary of Manawag, and for our personal intentions, the intentions of this Mass. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, bless us who are unworthy. Ituloy natin sa ating pagdarasal ang mga may sakit, lalong-lalo na nasa quarantine facilities. Pagdarasal din natin ang lahat ng mga namatay, lalong-lalo ng kanilang pamilya. Pagdarasal natin ang lahat ng mga frontliners, mga health workers. Father of all people, your son welcomed the faith of the centurion who came to him in humility and trust. Show us your favor as you make our prayers through Christ our Lord. Amen. Please be seated. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the bread we offer you, truth of the earth and work of human hands. It will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, Truth of divine and work of human hands, it will become our spiritual dream. Blessed be God forever. Please stand. Pray, my dear friends, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and the good of all this holy church. May the sacrifice which we gladly present 
in commemoration of St. John Chrysostom, be pleasing to you, O God, for taught by him we too give ourselves entirely to you in praise, through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is to be right and just, our duty and our salvation. Always and ever for to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, through Christ our Lord. For as in the festival of St. John Chrysostom, you bid your church rejoice, so too you strengthen her by the example of his holy life, teach her by his words of preaching, and keep her safe in answer to his prayers. And so with the company of angels and saints, we sing the hymn of your praise, as without end we acclaim. Pinapalang maparirito Sa ngala ng Panginoon O sana, o sana O sana sa kaitasan O sana, o sana Sana sa kalitasan. Please kneel. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, this gift you pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly, into his passion. He took bread and gave him thanks, broke it, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more gave thanks. He gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The Mystery of Faith
first we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we might be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis our Pope and Socrates our Archbishop, Fidelis his assistant, the relief, Jesus, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection, and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with Blessed Joseph, her spouse, with the Blessed Apostles, with our Father Saint Dominic, Saint John Chrysostom, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life, and we praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Throw him and wealth him are in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. At the Savior's command and form by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art, who art in heaven, heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, Deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we might be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, you said to your apostles, Peace I love you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will. Live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, grant us peace. Please kneel. Behold the Lamb of God, behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed.
act of spiritual communion. My Jesus, I believe that you are present in the most holy sacrament. I love you above all things, and I desire to receive you into my soul. Since I cannot at this moment receive you sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. I embrace you as if you were already there and unite myself fully to you, never permitting me to be separated from you. Amen. Please stand. What you say of me does not come from yourselves. It is the Spirit of my Father speaking in you. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets he promised to hold that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us, to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death, and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory, Glory to, to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy, Holy Spirit, Spirit, as it was in the beginning, now and will be forever. Amen. What, what you say of me does, does not come, come from yourselves. It is the Spirit of my Father speaking in you. Let us pray. Grant to merciful God that these mysteries we have received as we commemorate St. John Chrysostom may confirm us in your love and enable us to be faithful in confessing your truth through Christ, our Lord. Amen. Please be seated for an announcement. Brothers and sisters, good morning. The Dominican community of the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawa is pleased to inform you that the October Feast of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawa will be on October 3, 2021, first Sunday of October. The Novena Masses will be scheduled at 6 a.m., 7.30 a.m., 9 a.m., 10.30 a.m., 12 noon, and 4.30 p.m. from September 24 to October 3, 2021. Additional Mass at 3 p.m. on September 26, Sunday. We invite you to participate in these Novena Masses and be one with us in expressing our devotion to Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawa. If you wish to sponsor one or several of the Divina Masses, you may fill out the form at the counters for Masses area and submit it, submit it with your donation 
and you will be given an acknowledgement receipt. Or you may visit our website at www.manawagminorbasilica.org at Online Pamisa, where you will find available online and other options for donation. All names and donors of sponsors of the Novena Masses will appear in the electronic souvenir program. Thank you very much for your continued support. God bless. Please stand. Thank you also for joining us in this uh, online Eucharistic celebration. Uh, let us continue praying for one another, especially those who are sick and uh, affected by this uh, COVID-19, especially this Delta variant. Pagdasal natin ang bawat isa. Nasana po ang ating pamilya ay gagaling at maprotektahan. Isama natin sa ating pagdasal ang mga doctors, mga health workers natin, at uh, lalong-lalo na yung mga frontliners natin. Pagdasal nyo rin ang mga frontliners natin dito sa Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, lalong-lalo na ang ating mga radio staff. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Mass is ended. Go in peace. Thanks be to God. We will now have the blessing of our sick brothers and sisters. Please remember the names of your loved ones who are sick. We will also bless the religious articles. So during the prayers, pakilabas lang po yung mga religious articles na gusto niyo pablesan. Our hope is in the name of the Lord. Made heaven and earth. Let us pray. God, our Almighty Father, by your blessing, you give us strength and support in our frailty. Show your kindness toward our sick brothers and sisters. Free them from all illness and restore them to good health through the intercession of our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, so that in the sure knowledge of your goodness, they were grateful to bless your holy name. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. For your religious articles, in memory of the mysteries of the life, death, and resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ, to the honor and glory of the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of Christ, Mother of the Church, Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, may all these rosaries, images, candles, oil, and other religious articles be blessed and made holy in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.